Hey everybody, today we're gonna do an unboxing of the Johnny Cakes Cake Kit, which you can order now at thejohnnycakes.com. How many times can I say Johnny Cakes? It's like crazy. All right, so a lot of people have been asking me, is this cake kit good for beginners? The answer is absolutely. I actually tested the cake kit on my friends who are the worst bakers I know, and they did a great job. So if they can do it, you can do it for sure. So we're gonna dive right into this and let's get cutting. Just kidding, can you imagine? Yeah, no, that's a box. Uh, but I do want to cut it open. So I'm gonna open up this bad boy. All right, so when you get the box, you'll open it up. Oh! The first thing you're gonna see when you open the kit is an insert which has a QR code which will send you to a tutorial and it's a very in-depth tutorial, may I add. You're gonna, I mean, it's me, it's me. <laughs> Talk, 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 talk. I'm gonna lead you through each step of the process uh, as you create this cake at home. The tutorial to me is the most exciting part of this because I love like baking with people and sharing food with people. And now I can do that with people all around the world. So that's pretty cool. And then when you're done baking, you can take photos and videos, post them online, and I'll be able to see those. I'll react to a bunch of those. And I'm very excited for that because it kind of like is a two-way street. I'm in your kitchen and then you're kind of in my kitchen. So it's very exciting. I'm, I'm so excited for that. There's also ingredients and tools in the kit. So I'm gonna break down sort of each one of those categories. For the ingredients, we'll start with, <laughs> I mean, my favorite little guy, look how cute he is. A little pack of cornstarch, which will be your best friend while cake decorating. You'll see what I mean once you're in the kitchen. Cornstarch, you need, I promise. Maybe more exciting than the cornstarch for you is this bag of white chocolate wafers. And we got the pure white color so that that way when we make ganache with it, it looks like cereal milk. Like it looks like a white, white milk color. Um, they also are so freaking delicious. Probably my most exciting thing in the box though, I keep saying this is exciting, that's exciting. But another exciting thing is the Johnny Cakes cake mix. Um, this cake mix is truly so delicious. It is not your grandmother's box cake mix. It's, we tested like a million recipes and a million cake mixes and we landed on this one. It's moist, it's creamy, it's vanilla-y. And I, I really want you to believe me when I say this. I love this cake mix so much. I bought a 50 pound bag for myself just to like have on hand. Like 50, 50 pounds of cake mix. 50 pounds is like a child, like a big child, like third grade, right? Is that right? I mean, you know, I don't know how much, everybody weighs a different amount, but you get what I'm saying. The final food item is of course, Mr. Toucan Sam, the star of the show, the Fruit Loops. You get a cute little box, and this is more than enough Fruit Loops to decorate the cake. I love this cute little box. Imagine, okay, imagine this box is normal size, and I'm a, a giant. You can imagine, you get it, okay, cool. <laughs> and if you have other favorite cereals in your pantry that you wanna use instead, make your bowl different, go ahead. You can use Frosted Mini Wheats, you can use Rice Krispies, you can use literally any cereal you love. So you can be, dare to be different. <laughs> Also in the box, you're gonna get blue modeling chocolate. And the modeling chocolate will be like the actual bowl of the cake. It, it'll be like the shell, the chocolate shell that is the bowl. And it's, okay, so modeling chocolate is sort of like fondant, but it's chocolate. It, to me, tastes like a Tootsie Roll. And I think it tastes so much better than fondant because it's chocolatey. Um, so people who don't like fondant, I think will prefer this. This is Satin Ice. It's a super, super good product. Satin Ice makes my favorite fondants, modeling chocolates, all that good stuff. So I actually use this at home and it's high quality. So it's like something I'm proud to put in the cake kit. Another thing I'm proud of, everything, I'm actually like genuinely proud of everything and like happy about everything because we didn't cut costs to sacrifice quality. The last thing I would want is to send you a box of stuff that you'll never use again. Um, so when I was like, we need a high-end pan, I got the highest end pan. This is a fat daddy's pan. This is like what the legit bakers use. <laughs> Am I a legit baker? Because I use it. Like I actually use this at home. When you, when you get it, you'll feel it. It feels sturdy. It feels like you're gonna have it forever. And the cool thing about the sphere pan that you'll use both to bake the cake and also mold the modeling chocolate bowl out of is that you can do like a bunch of fun different cakes with this. So like everybody has a nine by 13 pan or a, a you know, a nine inch round cake pan. But what's fun about this is like, if you wanna do a globe shaped cake or a hat shaped cake, you can use these. And I use this pan like all the time. I made Mike Wazowski out of this. I use this for, for a top layer on my bucket hat cake. So it's very, very, it comes in handy all the time. Another Fat daddy -o item that comes in the kit is this offset spatula. So this is like crucial. This is when people ask me what's the first thing they should get when they start cake decorating, I say an offset spatula because it really keeps your hands out of it. You're not gonna hit it. You know, when you're like trying to like decorate a cake with like a butter knife and it gets all over the place, 
This is like that, but so much better. And this you will use literally, I don't think I've ever made a cake where I didn't use an offset spatula. So this was like, I guarantee it had to go in the kit. So I'm happy about that. We were gonna do these other offset spatulas, this little insider tea, and we were happy with them. And then we went to wash them at the end of the day. And the like stain that was on the wooden handle literally came off on my kitchen sponge. And I was like, stop, call the, call the guy, stop the press. We cannot put that in the kit. That would be ridiculous. Um, and these are great. I actually use this at home. So no, no cost cut, which I'm, very proud of. And then you get this beautiful, beautiful tissue paper. I mean, you can do, you can wrap it around you like a scarf. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But you do get this. And you know what I would do if I got this? I would repurpose it <laughs> for my friend's birthday gift. And you know what? You can even, put, <laughs> you get a box. You, you get a whole box. You can put, look at all the things. I can put my phone. I can put this knife in it. I mean, look at that box. It's got my name on it. You can say property of Johnny. <laughs> This is crazy, but you do get a box. So I don't know if that's, what if, that, what if you watch this whole video and you're like, oh, I'm not gonna buy that kit. And then you're like, wait, I get a box and tissue paper? Um, okay, wow, I'm, I can't ever, I thought this video would be like normal, can't. Now you might be wondering, what doesn't come in the cake kit? Great question. You'll get a shopping list on that insert I talked about earlier, which will tell you all the items you need to get at the grocery store. It's just three sort of like perishable items that we couldn't put in the box, or we could, but they, you know, poison you. So we didn't want to do that. And you'll also need some, you know, items from your kitchen. Uh, those are staples like a sharp knife, a cutting board, a rolling pin. And then otherwise you're set to go. You're going to be the best baker in the world, even if you're a beginner baker. All right. So there you have it. Everything that comes in the cake kit. I'm so excited for you guys to receive these. And I'm even more excited to see uh, all the photos that you tag on Instagram, TikTok, all over social media. I cannot wait to react to as many of these cakes as possible. So you know what to do. Go to thejohnnycakes.com right now. Right now, open up a new tab and go. To open up a new tab though, don't cut me off. I'm still talking here.